Hey guys, we're back here. We're doing another <laughs> tier list and this one is a coward's tier list because I'm with a bunch of people that didn't want to rank mascots based on ferocity. They preferred to instead rank them on mascots in general. I personally am going to choose to only rank them on ferocity. <laughs> so there's going to be some other discussion in here too, which is, I guess, the quality of the mascot, the history of the mascot, but probably social media presence of the mascot. That's probably got to be in there too. Yeah, that's probably if they... Let's get into the actual list. Yes. Marissa, you're first on my screen, so we'll give you the first ranking. You have the New Jersey Devils, and sorry, the New Jersey Devil. I just feel like the Devil is iconic. He's so on brand. Like, you can't deviate from the fact like, oh, the Devils have a Devil as a mascot. I don't personally enjoy the look of him. He doesn't spark joy. I feel like mascots also need to spark some kind of joy. Would I prefer <laughs> David Putty as their mascot, 100%. But for me, I feel like he's middle to upper tier. I'm gonna, I'm gonna let him slide at B. If anyone wants to contest me on this, please do. Do you mean like just like actually having like David Putty, like a human mascot, yes. like how <laughs> like Notre Dame does it, which looks so weird. For the devils, the devils. Personally, I like the devil a little bit more than this, just because one that the the glass clip is hilarious. <laughs> I feel like he's got more mobility than a lot of the other mascots. I feel like he could really, you know, like what? use his- uh, what, are you even, what are you even judging that on? Other than that he ran through glass. What makes him more <laughs> he mobile does look than nimble. a bunch of these other He does ones? look well, like, nimble. Compared, compared to Gritty, right? Like Gritty or like the guys with the big, big belly suits. Those guys can't move. We're forgetting the most important part here. I think the devil is the biggest Bar Down fan. Well, okay, I changed, I changed my mind. I changed my mind. He's A. He, he goes to A. Does everybody Devil's agree an A. a? That's an A. I would yeah. say they could have shied away from him being the devil and just made it something wimpy and devil-like. They just like, no, it's the, it's devil. the devil. Satan <laughs> is our mascot. <laughs> All right, next mascot. Let's do this. So this is actually kind of a test. What's this one's? Is this one's name Stormy? Uh, yes. But okay, don't they have like a Stormy. live pig mascot? Oh yeah, so. they got both. So this one's low for me because the, the, the one that's alive is better. Who's ranking this one, by the oh, way? Oh, it's you. I don't, I'm just talking. <laughs> okay, well, this one's easy. No offense, Carolina fans, but why is your mascot something that you want to kill and eat? <gasps> that doesn't make any sense at all. I'm out. Doesn't make any sense. That's a, <laughs> a D. Sorry, Z, a D. if, we're, if we, we do need to figure out why we're ranking this, like if it's like in terms of deliciousness, like is that like the- <laughs> Oh, well then it's an A, <laughs> probably the best. Okay, so it's in a D. Is anyone moving it up or anything or? Well, I think it should be C because you guys are being rude to pigs, but whatever. <laughs> no, pig, pigs rule, but this is, is a hog. <laughs> I agree with D as well. Jesse, you're up with your boy. <laughs> Darn right I'm up. Listen, do you know who I, that is, by the way? Yeah, what's yeah, his name? Yeah, you have to name. name. What's his name? <laughs> it's Crater? Who's Crater? I hate the Vegas Golden Knights. I hate them. Okay? <laughs> They're my least favorite hockey team. But I got to say, I think they've got the best mascot in the league. Go ahead and stick them in the best. Are you serious? The best. Wow. Get, get Crater right up there. Lots of respect and, for Geo, dude. I'm gonna vote uh, Crater down to D because his ferociousness <laughs> is brutal. He's not ferocious get at all. Get out of here. He's That's very, only one category. He's a That's very one tiny category. lizard. I agree with Corwin. It should be bumped down to D because we don't even know what he is. And Jesse didn't even know what his name was. He still doesn't know what his name is, obviously. I'm gonna be real annoying the rest of this video if, if he gets moved to anywhere lower than an A. Are you serious? Yeah. I believe I'm yeah. having a fit. What does that mean? Yeah. I believe him. Based on that, I'll, Great. I'll, I'll, I'll put him at B. <laughs> I just want to see whatever oh, yeah. this threat is. From yeah, let's see what, let's see what yeah, it looks so, like. So let's I'm go going for a B. Fine, B? fine. I'll agree B. Sam, nominate this penguin. Iceberg? He's fine. Plays in a good hockey town. Pittsburgh's a nice place. I think he's a B. He's not He's not wowing me. Ferocity, mediocre, if I'm being honest. Oh, that's a good this call, the, Sam. Not that ferocious. This is the only one where you actually could rank it on ferocity because he got his ass kicked by Jean-Claude Van Damme. <laughs> so yeah, ferocity, <laughs> D. I would put him a little bit lower. He's pretty basic. Honestly, Z, yeah. as much as he got beat up, he's also in a Jean-Claude Van Damme movie, right? Like that's that still, is pretty, that's cool. pretty crazy. I feel like a B's right. <laughs> I would settle with a C if if it's I, gonna create I issues. I agree, I would settle with C too. He's a little forgettable because he's basic. Honestly, okay, uh, if you guys put okay, him to a C, I'm gonna make the rest of this video hard <laughs> on you guys. <laughs> yeah, I, I, like, I like how we, uh, Jesse said that and so far the video has continued at the exact same difficulty. <laughs> Reagan, you are up with <laughs> Whatever that is. <laughs> <laughs> it looks like <laughs> Carlton the knockoff, which is even worse. 
Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to say okay. a D because I don't know who came first, but realistically, it is a knockoff of Carlton. Reagan, have you considered this? The polar bear is the most ferocious bear. So <laughs> no, it's not. No, it's not. The grizzly. Isn't it grizzly? Bear is I don't. Ferocious. I don't know. Exactly. I've, I've heard polar bears are more ferocious. Corin, Corin, we have discussed this because <laughs> Churchill, Manitoba, is the polar bear capital of the world. Okay. And did you guys know that polar bears' fur is actually clear? It's not even white. Like, <laughs> what's the deal with that? Thank you for subscribing to Polar Bear Facts. If you want to know why it's a bear, here yeah, it is. Fair. Apparently, when he was old enough, the blue bear traveled all the way to St. Louis to meet the Blues, and after meeting the team. He was inspired with their high energy and great teamwork. So he just hung out. So as we're saying, <laughs> he's a C or a D. <laughs> Let's bump him down. Yeah. Maybe, maybe yeah. the worst mascot in the league. I wouldn't do delete this. I'd probably give him a D. To just put a bear as your mascot because of that reason is kind of weird in my opinion. Wait, what was that horn? <laughs> that horn was comical. But <laughs> my <opinion. laughs> It sounds like a boat. Yo, Louis outside your Louis outside your <laughs> ass. <laughs> yeah, I, I'm fine with a D though. Yeah, I think that's correct. Yeah, that's a D. So I'm up with Nash. I'm giving him an A because he's extremely ferocious. Could could like really do some damage to a human? I don't even want to entertain his stupidity. Just keep it in an A. <laughs> You're right. He's very ferocious. As a saber toothed tiger, I'm surprised he's made it this long too. So that's also like you know, it stands to like how ferocious he probably is. Okay, so are we agreeing it belongs in A? Yeah, based on ferocity, let's keep it in an A. Yeah, that's fair. Not based on <laughs> ferocity. Like Nash. Based on his ferocity. I believe Marissa is up with whatever the Phoenix Coyotes mascot is called. All right, his name is Howler. If we're rating on ferociousness, obviously he belongs in A, if that's just gonna be our main barometer here. Yeah, good um, call. He looks so friendly. Guys, you don't, you don't trifle with coyotes. That looks like Yogi the Coyote. Couldn't be friendlier. <laughs> He has ferocity, so he can be ferocious, but he's also super cuddly. Like, you can't tell me that this guy doesn't belong with Nash in the same tier. He, I he, can't. He, 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 he doesn't belong. He sucks. Are you guys serious? Are you serious? Are you serious? Are you serious? Like the worst mask on the list. Listen, he wears the M for his franchise, okay? He wears the M for his franchise. Let's put a little respect on the mascot's name. Let's put a little respect on the mascot's name. What the hell does that mean? Like, you know how there's like Captain and stuff like that? He wears the M. Well, there's only one person that can wear it, and it's the mascot. There's only one captain. That's, that's not extra. <laughs> okay, how about this? He's True, cold fair. because he wears 96 because that's when the Jets left and he's like, yeah, whatever. Like, Shut he's up, cold. Sam. That's all I'm that saying. <laughs> you know what I mean? Now there's up, ferocity. Yeah. That is pretty ferocious if I'm being honest. <laughs> Marissa's going to submit A Why? and yeah, then no. do the rest of us want to vote B? C. 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 Come on, See? like what? What's you special guys, about that mascot? It's wrapped up. You guys, that is brutal. Yeah, you can at least put it to B. That that's that would, that's not even. That's the risk <laughs> you take when <laughs> no. you put him in the A team. Z, you're up with Finn, the Vancouver Canucks mascot. Their mascot is their logo. It matches. Cool name, Finn the Whale. Is it that cool? Nah. It's all right. I'd just give it a B. I would say Finn, like legit, could be the coolest mascot in the you, league. You it's can't even. Whale. That's like, a just, hot take. It's so, why, why is Finn not the coolest mascot in the league? Because I think he's pretty wicked. He's just a whale. It's fitting. <laughs> it's fitting, I guess, go, because of the Canucks. Go on. But he's literally <laughs> like, just a whale. Orca <laughs> whales are literally the, the, One of the biggest badasses animals. in the world. They're One the, of the coolest. coolest animals. They, they are. They are the definition of ferocious okay they eat everything yes uh, that okay i agree <laughs> they eat other whales they're crazy after the arguments have all been shared i'm kind of okay with b i like b if we're being honest he could slot into the actual canucks lineup anytime apparently so <laughs> he's available so this one this guy he his name is uh majin Nordy. majin nordy Jesse, you're ranking him. I don't really know what to think of this mascot. I, I look at it and, and I'm, I'm honestly just confused. So for that reason, I'm just gonna give it a, give it a C because it's <laughs> right, in the, right in the middle. Yeah, yeah, I, I, I agree. Like not not super ferocious, but a little ferocious. Whoa, Nordy has a mullet, by the way, so. What? Yeah. What? Oh. Okay, okay, whoa. <laughs> Whoa! Straight, straight up? <laughs> yeah. Whoa. Here's some information okay. for you there. Nordy has okay. a mullet. Changer. You can go ahead and rise up that list. Yeah, yeah, Game okay, changer. okay. Mm -hmm. At first I looked at this guy, I was like, this is just like some some basic mascot. I don't care about him, but mm -hmm. I mean rise now, up. Now he's now he's got a mullet. And, is he the uh, best? I'm gonna stick him in an A. Yes! That's unreal. That is as moist of a loaf <laughs> as I've ever seen on a mascot, and you bet your 
you bet your bottom he's he's going right in A. Sam, you're up with one of the mascots with one of the worst names because the, the Tampa Bay Lightning and the bug is a thunder bug. You got the thunder. You got the lightning. Whoa. Okay, that's I right. Do Sam, that is true for ferocity. That, a little bit of thunder, <laughs> a, little, a little bit of lightning. A little shake and bake, you know what I'm saying? I got one memory uh, of, of Thunderbug, and that's the Silly String video. Hi, this is Captain David Bacon. Captain David Bacon. Captain David Bacon. Thunderbug did one of these, Adam, and then, like as he was being kicked out of the game, and I was like, I like that. That's wait, gross. wait, wait, wait. Is this one of those scenarios where Sam doesn't understand that it was set up and fake, or did this <laughs> actually happen? No, they don't. You guys it's, keep Sam spreading... thinks that ushers are just like unexpectedly so you think you can dance champions. <laughs> you, got, you guys are absolutely throwing these mascots like they're selling them huh? up the risk. Sam, Sam's, like, Sam's like, you know when the mascots are salt fans with cakes they like slam it into their face that's a real fan we get that it happened but like that was obviously staged that person knew they were getting a cake in the face how much you want to bet there's an article on this where apparently thunderbug was fired for that <laughs> oh, wait, so what is so, well, unless, they're get, unless they're getting real deep with their storylines here <laughs> <laughs> That's very ferocious. I apologize, Sam. <laughs> Honestly, for for that reason, it's still not good enough. Your seat. I'm actually gonna go lower. I think I think Thunderbug might be the single worst mascot in the NHL. Bold take. Are you trying? What to are y'all laughing at? I mean, Jesse. In terms of ferocity, he really does not look that ferocious, and and he didn't put up much of a fight when that Bruins fan attacked him. See I say. C or D for sure. Yeah, exactly. Get get it in D. Sorry, Thunderbug. I tried. Okay, Reagan, you're up. With J Jesse, do you, do you want to do the honors on this one? I just want to remind everyone that before you say, why the hell is a moose the Winnipeg Jets mascot? Because we used to be called the Manitoba moose, but we just kept Mickey the moose. And to be honest, I actually don't think we should have kept <laughs> Mickey the moose. I don't know why our, our mascot is a moose. But <laughs> anyways, take it away, Riggs. <laughs> I'm following you on that one. I don't love it. I don't hate it. It doesn't really do anything for me. I'm going to throw it in a C. I understand the moose, I guess, because of the Manitoba thing and Winnipeg, but doesn't really do anything for me much. Is the Manitoba moose, like, what's their mascot now? I think it's also Mickey, Mickey no, the moose. That's, He's that's doing not. double He's duty? He's moonlighting? Okay, put him in a D. I feel like for that reason, put him in a D, yeah, exactly. Put yeah, him whoa. In a D. I'm happy with D. I, honestly, I, <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. I'm gonna stick in a C. Moose are like pretty ferocious, so I think C's a good, uh, good ranking. I think that was a 3-3 vote, so stays the same, I think. Okay, wild wing. Huge one here. <sighs> Massive. I think extreme ferocious spooky mask sam just to be clear this isn't a spookiness ranking this is based on ferociousness i'm gonna go a i don't think he's the most ferocious but he's ferocious so since we're not ranking on ferociousness here's a, a counterpoint just to add to that it was a character in its own cartoon also just looks super cool how they made a goalie mask somehow look like a duck's face yeah. and it all works. And he's, that he's, is an A. That was the coolest toy you could have. If I'm looking at all the people ranked below A, like he could beat all them up for sure. Does the Ring of Fire add or take away from his legend here? Or add. I should say his add grade. To. Definitely add. add. Yeah. Add's, okay, well, well then the it's an A. That was an attempt. I feel like I want to bump him up to one of the best. I, I right. feel like he he truly is. Like I even had like just part of my Ninja Turtle set at home. Like I also had this guy. There's something special about him you know he, he's uh span decades here okay so we all agree wild wing could beat up everybody currently on the list so he's at the best most ferocious and yeah uh, marissa you're up with uh <laughs> you be. I feel like it's only fair that, you know, every person gets to, to set the stage for their favorite team's mascot. Yeah. I, th I feel like Riggs take it away here and then uh, and then we'll get going. I don't love him though, so I don't want, I don't want that passion <laughs> about him. Reagan, why? He kind of scares me in a way. He kind of looks creepy. Like if you saw this guy on the street, you'd just be like, get away from me type hey. of vibe. But I feel, <laughs> I, feel like, I feel like Montreal just has a thing, or Quebec in general has a thing for those kinds of mascots, no? What's the mascot for the Winterfest? Bonhomme. Bonhomme, yes, Bonhomme, same vibe. Like Bonhomme is horrifying. UP is a legend. <laughs> like I, I have nothing bad to say about UP because of his legendary status. This guy is the first hall mascot, of hall of famer, first mascot to be two, kicked out of a baseball athlete. game. Tommy Lasorda complained about him. And third base umpire Bob Davidson is throwing UP out of the ball game. He wants him off the Dodger dugout. Tommy Lasorda has put up a complaint. When you have a man, a legend like Tommy Lasorda complain about you, okay, you get to be ranked at the top of the list. He's top tier when it comes to mascots that you think of in the world. 100%. He's it. Based on that, he's pretty ferocious, so I would agree. Like, are you thinking A? I'm thinking the best. I, I think he's think I'm legendary, a, I'm thinking but does he fit that 
that mascot vibe. I think he actually is like the quintessential mascot. I think that like when I think of a mascot, it's someone like Yippie. And he's got an absolute boiler and he loves shaking it around. Whoever made Gritty, you have to think that they looked at Yuppie and were like, yes. yeah, we're going to just like take that yeah. beard out of there and like the whole gut action. Like, nah, Yuppie's a legend. I think Wild Wing could beat Yuppie up. So I'm, I'm voting Yuppie down to an A. Yuppie's an A. I'm happy with an A. He's a two sport athlete. Yeah, I, I agree. He's, yeah. Just, he's, he's just like, the best. A wrestler, just the, just the best. He's, All right. He is. No, I'll, I'll, I'll go the best. Whoa, whoa. Okay, so Reagan, whoa. you're deciding here. Okay. A or the best? I have to give him an A. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> nice. History is important, but it's not the only thing. Yeah, like ferocity. Z, you are up with the legendary Al the Octopus. Got a lot of arms there to fight with. Uh, so <laughs> how ferocious is he? So not ranking on ferociousness. Uh, that's an iconic mascot right there. I mean, when you think of animals that are for some reason associated with teams, you think of the octopus, you think of the Red Wings, that's just an A. It's a little bit of a shame that they tried to sell the original one. That's not that cool. It also bucks the trend of like fuzzy mascots, you know what I mean? It bucks the trend of not employing somebody to be in a mascot uniform, okay? This is so rude. Hey, I'm sorry, <laughs> but I, I feel like this needs to go in the bin. This needs to be deleted. What? No. Deleted. No. It's the only one of its kind. It's iconic. It's not even Listen. a mascot, you guys. It's just something that they that the stadium has. So A or delete this, I'm going A. A. Yeah, I think a. it's an A. I, I think it's staying where it is. Uh, okay, Jesse, you're up with the, what's his name, Harvey? Harvey the Hound or something? Harvey the Hound is an absolute beauty. He like has arguably the most iconic mascot moment in NHL history. That's my kind of guy right there. He's ferocious. He also likes to stir the pot. Love it. I'm gonna have to stick him in an, in an A. Pretty good mascot. <sighs> I'm with you there, yeah. I, I, think I, you, I got nothing against yeah. that. Yeah. All right, let's keep the ball rolling then. Sabretooth is going to Sam. Super cool that you're a Sabretooth. You are not the best Sabretooth uh, mascot in the NHL. For that reason alone, you are a D. I am sorry. I'm with you there, because like, one, he's kind of goofy looking. Not ferocious. Who's got Carlton? Carlton, I believe, is Reagan. Carlton, Carlton, Carlton. I think the Leafs <laughs> dropped the ball with this one. <laughs> Love the name, he's cute, he's adorable, but they had a lot they could have worked with and done a better job, so I'm gonna Oof. give him a D, just because there's not, Oof. he's just a bear. Sorry, Leaf fans. And like, kind of a cuddly bear, you know? But like, what else could they have really worked with? What do you do for a Leaf? Honestly, go straight Stanford, make it a tree. I feel like he's a nice cuddly bear, you're right, but compared to other Toronto mascots, he does he's the He's just least. not that ferocious, Carlton's, right? a, Carlton's a coward. Boring, he's boring. That he likes to have fun. Do you guys remember yeah. when he scared the, the Leafs on Halloween? Because I kind of like that. <laughs> He is so ferocious that an inflatable version of him spooked. Actually, I can kind of get that behind behind that, Sam. Yeah, he is pretty ferocious and he's really yeah. spooked him there. Yeah, let's bump him to C. Let's bump him to C, okay? I'm I cool like with leave, him, leave him in D. C leave for Carlton. But is it biased because yeah, you're a Leaf fan? Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, yeah, yeah. No, he, yeah. <laughs> we'll, we'll keep him in D. Really quick, this thing is brutal and I'm deleting it. <laughs> <laughs> Colin, it's, it's Colin, that's the one I was gonna say. <laughs> yeah. yeah, it's a scary like, one. What, what? What is this wet mop of a mascot? <laughs> You guys, Ottawa already has it bad enough. And he ain't but, helping. But what the hell were they thinking when they made this mascot? It is so bad. Any mascot could beat the hell out of this thing. It's a, you gotta get rid of it. Get, get a new mascot. You have a very ferocious Spartan that you could choose instead and you chose not That's to. That's true. Well, look at that haircut, haircut too. Like that is that is the biggest, biggest Munson of a mascot ever. Look at the picture too that we use in the tier list. He's like posing like the font. <laughs> that is the worst mascot of all time. The mascot actually looks like, like Mark Davis. <laughs> I don't think I feel as strongly as you guys about it, but I definitely don't like it. Its jibs are all out of place too. Like, it's just, it's just, a, <laughs> there, there's, there's, there's literally nothing right about this mascot. Marissa, you're up with- I have Hunter. Yeah. If you're basing off of ferocity alone, obviously this guy is like one of the best. Look at his face. Look, he's ready to just get some things done. And I also like the history of it. Like they named him Hunter because of the original owner of the Oilers. Like they're, pay they're paying tribute to a man who brought them life. And, and I kind of adore that. Do I feel like it fits into the rest of the, you know, oil town vibe? Not really. And for that reason, I think he should go and B. I think the, all the ones in A and, and the one in Wild Wing could beat him up. So I think B is fine. He's, whoa. He's the only you're, mascot you're with a six pack. Yeah, yeah he's whoa. got a six pack. I forgot about that. Oh, I, forgot I did about forget. The six pack. 
I guys, he's shredded. Oh my god. I like Hunter. I like, right? like I, I'm happy. Uncle. I'm happy with Uncle. A or B. Yeah, but, I like Hunter. Uh, Z, you're up with the bear. Laid the bear. Uh, it's a bear because they're the Bruins. I get it. It's okay. And if I'm being honest, if you've ever seen that bear in the gang video that they had, where it was just some other weird bear mascot that looked way funnier. That should have been your mascot. This just looks a little bit generic. I'd give it a C. I'll, I'll put it in the C, but I, I do think he actually looks a little tough. Like, I think he could I, I, really You know hold what? Sorry. Own. I said C. I said C. I mean B. It's a decent mascot. Yeah, you agree he's he's a little, he looks pretty tough. So I, he, he's I don't agree ferocious. with that part. I don't care about that part. I don't get the hype. <laughs> what hype? <laughs> I, I, I think mean, it's... What? Uh, that's what kind of sucks. No, no one's lining up for this bear. There's no hype. Yeah, why? Yeah. Well, like, well, why do you? Why do you think? Why it does sucks? he suck? Because he's he. It's such a generic mascot. Like, could it be any more boring? It could be the Jets mascot. We'll be talking. Jesse's Jet, like, let's Mickey Mickey please Moose. move on. You, you talk did. smack about Mickey Moose. <laughs> You can't shred other teams for not having mascots that fit their logo and then being like, oh, we, oh, cool, you're the Bruins, so you chose a bear? That's stupid. Like, no, you can't have it both ways. Like, like get a little more creative. Like, this thing just, like, it's very, it's a very bland mascot. I don't know. Yeah, and that's why it's a B. Jesse, you're up with I'm Bailey. Delete this. <laughs> no, I, I actually think Bailey's great. And, and Bailey also has a great social media presence. Kind of looks like the Beast from Beauty and the Beast. I'm going to throw... Bailey in, I think B. Uh, the man who looks like Gritty is up to rank Gritty, Sam. I was hoping that th this time would come uh, and I would be able to place uh, this slack-jawed, lovely, lovely mascot at the <laughs> apex of our tier list. You look at the Ducks mascot, lovely. And he had his time to be the best. And now it's Gritty's turn to shine. He's an icon. And for that reason, He's the best. But he's not that ferocious. Just those eyes. He haunts a lot of people's dreams. Oh no, what did we do? He's probably your worst nightmare when you first see him. Let's see who it is! Get back here! What are you doing? He's the most famous thing in the world. He was on The Tonight Show. Gang! <laughs> At one point, he was the most popular figure in the NHL. Like more so than Connor McDavid, more so than Austin Matthews, more so than than any player. He's Gritty's the best. The best. Come yeah, on, like, when this isn't really a like, question. He's a yeah, think question. of how many cakes Gritty's were made for this man, for this face. Well, it sounds like he's moving. We're we're moving wild wing down. If we're being honest about the ferocity here, he's a B probably. I think we can all agree that Philadelphia has the best sports fans in, I no. think, any market. I won't no. do that. Yes. What? No. Don't no. they that throw no batteries at their The most passionate like sports fans I've ever That's seen. No. That's no. Yes. I would say one of the Maybe worst. We're ranking the sports fans on oh ferocity. For me, Philly is up there. I feel like they needed somebody to show off and showcase that fandom. And I feel like this mascot does exactly that. What's a worse take? Philly having the best sports fans or Brain Holby being an illegal? <laughs> <laughs> they're, both, they're both piping hot takes. I'm going to pass the torch to you, yeah. Marissa, for worst <laughs> yeah. takes in bar down history. Down, down. Reagan, you're up with? Victory Green. Already not ferocious because puns are the opposite of ferocity. I think we should just delete this. Kind of looks like a cartoon. <laughs> It's kind of grosses me out too, to be honest. So. Is, <laughs> is, is he an alien? It's like a hairy what slug thing, and it for sure looks like a bugger, for sure. Okay, we all agree with delete this. Poor guy. Uh, Stinger, honestly, pretty ferocious. If I'm being honest, like he's he's got a bit of uh, an edge to him. It looks like yeah, he kind of looks a little bit like a psycho, you know. I don't think he's on the level of like that A tier, but I'll, I'll put him in B. Not many mascots end up on their team's actual uniform. Form. So, I mean, that's just new levels of cool, too. And also, like, has Torts ever bunched him? Probably not. Probably would, though, if he got the chance. Now we are down to Marissa. You're ranking Sharky. Sharky. Sharky is sick. I really like him a lot. Um, I like his attitude when he's out there. The guy knows how to skate. He knows how to play. He knows how to get a crowd going. I appreciate his vibe. I appreciate the fact that he is the team. He is the logo. Like, he is the guy. He fits the team perfectly. For that reason, he belongs in A. He also has the most iconic moment, no? When he repelled from the ceiling. Never have we had a mascot suspended in midair causing a delay. That's a real iconic moment. Where do you want to rank him in, on the letter scale? And why is it A? I like him, yeah, I like him at A. <laughs> an A. Yeah, that's an A. Oh yeah, Easy. I agree. Z, you are up with Sparky the Dragon mascot. One of the ones that makes <laughs> the least sense in the entire league. Okay, real quick, the origin story is definitely whack for this mascot. It used to be New York's arena football team's mascot, 
And then there's like, yeah, you can be the mascot of an NHL team. So <laughs> that's a D. Oh, they imagine just imagine if they had a fisherman. Yeah. That yeah, like so so that's where you bring, yeah. I don't like the fisherman Jake jersey that much, but you bring yeah. back the fisherman for a mascot. Hell yeah. Sorry, you don't think he should just be deleted because they should just get a new mascot? Like it should, should it, Yeah, that's actually yeah. fair. You know what? Delete it. Jesse, you are up with, I, I actually don't know the name of this one. Is it Eddie the Eagle or something? It's Slapshot. Look, I, I think Slapshot's very cool. I think bald eagles in general are like the coolest. Very ferocious, Corwin. Good call. So I am going to, I'm going to stick Slapshot in B. I think that's pretty good. Okay, Sam, you are up with Bernie the St. Bernard mascot of the Colorado Avalanche. Shout out, Luca. I feel like this makes a lot of sense. Usually Bernie. like with, with mascots, they're a little on the nose or it's a bit of leap of faith. I feel like a St. Bernard makes a lot of sense. He rocks a number one in the shape of a bone for his number. I don't think he's a category but he's like high he's a b plus is he that ferocious though like i feel like he's more like howler or medium growler, ferocious like, it's a dog yeah. that saves lives i, like I think it's a that's b a, i think it's that's a b. a b or an a reagan you're up with stanley c panther he like flipped my hat and just <laughs> walked away like it was nothing in public there was so many people there <laughs> And for that, for that an A. I personally am going to say that this guy sucks. <laughs> <laughs> knock, knock him down may, might be the worst. And uh, I'd like to think I could take him in a fight. So You had a chance to take him in a fight and you didn't do you didn't anything. Didn't exactly. didn't and you know it. why, guys? Because... He looked too ferocious. Okay, so sorry, we got a double of the Islanders uh, guy there. We'll just delete him again. That's a double delete. Yeah, just an, another angle again. to see how bad that is. And then, okay, guys, so this is going to be a bit of a hot take. I think right here with Tommy Hawk, I think he's the only mascot deserving to be in the mascot ferocity hall of fame because he beat the <laughs> hell out of a fan. You can see the Blackhawks mascot here, Tommy Hawk, duking it out with a fan at the United Center. Oh my gosh. According to the Sun Times and Chicago Police, the mascot was punched and put into a headlock by the fan before the mascot body slammed that guy into the <laughs> ground. Wrong. Corwin, get out of here with that absolute yeah. trash take. If, no, if he good. stays at the top, this whole list is not null and void. At best, he's a C. I I'd go C or B. I would do B. All right, let's end this up. Does anybody have uh, anybody that they want to change? I feel like Al should be bumped down to C. Pass. I would legitimately like to bump Crater up to A. I don't, I'm not into Crater. Anyways, we, we ranked a list and it, it doesn't really make much sense. This doesn't <laughs> appear to me to be at all how a fight in the mascot world would go. You guys requested we do this video and then it's the most, probably the most chaotic video we've ever done. And because I don't know <laughs> if there's any logic in any of what we said, but but we made it to the end. <laughs> and that's, <laughs> that's, 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 Hopefully you did too. Yeah, if, if you did, that is an accomplishment. And uh, tell us what else you want us to rank and tell us which mascots we got wrong on the ferocity meter. I'm assuming there's gonna be a lot. Hey, should we rank goal horns? Did I forget to shave my mustache?